my week 26 bump date. Um, this week, baby is as big as an eggplant or as long as a scallion. Not really sure what a scallion is and I don't eat too many eggplants, but my app did tell me that the baby is about two pounds now. Um, so I cannot believe he has already gained a whole nother pound. Um, I thought it was crazy when he was just one pound and now he's two pounds. Um, I definitely can tell he's getting bigger. Um, it already feels like he's running out of room. I can feel him stretch out um, on the sides of my belly and the top of my belly. Um, and so I think it's just kind of crazy that I'm only 26 weeks. How is he gonna fit in there at 40 weeks, you know? This week, baby's eyes are starting to open. Um, his brain waves are becoming um, that uh, similar to a newborn. He is also hearing a lot better. Um, they say that at this week, um, baby can definitely hear my voice, definitely hear Anthony's voice, and he will react to my voice. Um, so when I'm talking, a lot of times I can feel him move and bump around, um, and I think it's just him responding to my voice. So it's really cute to get to feel and get that reaction out of him. So symptoms this week. Um, the best symptom is I have no more back pain, which is crazy. So if you've been following me in my previous videos, um, I went, I don't know when I started feeling it. I mean, back in the teens, before I was in my 20 weeks, um, I started getting this pain in my back. Um, and it was always on my left side. Um, and it would be like my lower, maybe middle left back. And then I would also have a pain on my left ribs. And it was just constant. Um, it wouldn't be too bad if I was standing, walking around, but if I was sitting, it would be really bad. I'd have to put a pillow behind me. And I even went and bought a belly band to help me. And the belly band did help a little bit, um, but I still had a lot of back problems. But this week, I don't have any back problems at all, which leads me to believe Believe that the back pain was probably baby and he probably has moved positions switched around I don't know but he has moved in a way that he is not putting as much pressure on my spine and my back and it feels wonderful it is so nice to not have to constantly have to get up and walk around because my back is hurting. Um, I just feel so much better. So the back pain is gone. Um, I don't know if it's gone forever, but for now I'm feeling great. Another symptom is my heartburn. My heartburn has gotten so bad lately. Um, I talked about that in my last video too, but it's like every day I have to take heartburn now. And it's especially bad when I go to lay down. Um, it, I just feel that, you know, that heartburn, that sensation in my chest, and it just kills. Um, it's the worst at night right before I go to bed. Um, thankfully, I have, I have Tums, and Tums are doing the trick. Um, sometimes I have to take Tums more than once a day. Um, but other than that, um, my heartburn has really gotten bad this week. I have noticed myself starting to get tired um, a lot easier. Um, today was my first day back at work after the holiday break and I just feel so drained. I'm so tired. I just want to take a nap. Um, and I went to bed, you know, at a good time and I sleep in, you know, I wake up at like 8 a.m. every day. So it's not like I'm waking up super early. Um, and the past couple nights, I've just wanted to go to bed starting at like 11 o'clock or maybe even earlier. So I'm definitely starting to get more fatigued easier. Um, definitely bringing me back to the first trimester when I was having a lot of fatigue. I haven't noticed any stretch marks on my belly at all, which is awesome because I mean, my belly is definitely stretching. I can tell, you can tell by looking at my bump, um, but I have not seen any stretch marks yet. Um, I'm still rubbing my lotion on my belly every day and also on my boobs. Um, and it does seem to be helping the stretch marks that are on my boobs. They do seem to be lessening a little bit. I still find myself really hungry all the time. Um, I'm trying to watch it and trying to eat healthier and um, not as big of meals. Um, I have not weighed myself yet. Um, I'm kind of scared to do so just because I 
think I gained a lot over the holiday break, um, you know, with all the sweets and cookies and things like that. So um, I will tell you next week what I am weighing at. The biggest thing that I have noticed this week um, is having to do with baby, and it's just beforehand, whenever I would feel baby move, it would be a kick here, a jab there, a poke there. Um, they were all they all felt like pokes, and it would just be one and every so often. Now, this week, I've noticed a huge difference where instead of just feeling a poke, I feel baby like move like his whole like limb across my belly. I'll feel him drag it like across the inside of my belly. Um, and so that's really cool to feel. And then also baby will kick and jab and hit all at once. And, and so it just feels like baby is like practicing his boxing moves and he um, is taking it out on my skin. So he, it's, his movements are way more noticeable. I, noticeable. I notice them way more often. Um, and so it's kind of fun to feel him move around. He's active much more um, than, and than in previous weeks. I feel him a lot more now, um, especially in the mornings. Um, some, again, I, sometimes I still wake up, you know, in the middle of the night, um, in the very early morning, um, just wide awake, and baby will be kicking like crazy. Um, and then at night, uh, he's pretty active as well. And Anthony has gotten plenty of time to put his hand on my belly and feel baby kicking and he's felt baby moving and he likes to play with baby. He'll, you know, push a little bit on my side and baby will move over. Or um, like I've said in previous vlogs, my baby is very sassy and so any pressure on my belly at all, he does not like. Um, and he will go to that point and uh, tap against it, like get it off of me. So, you know, if I'm resting my hand on my belly, he'll be pushing up against my hand. If I put my phone on my belly, same thing. Anthony was balancing his phone on my belly and baby was kicking it. We could see the phone move. Um, this past weekend we went to the movies and we haven't been to the movies in a long time uh, we went and saw the new star wars movie and the entire movie baby was kicking like crazy um i don't know if maybe he just didn't really like the really loud noise from the movie um but it was really cute to feel him and then of course anthony had his arm laying against my belly as well and um baby uh, was kicking his arm like the almost the entire time and it's really cute to see Anthony say that to me like baby is kicking or oh my gosh I felt that and he'll have a little smile and it makes me smile and feel good like you know I'm, I'm hoping he's creating a bond with baby I know it's